Hello there. Kings back in his hometown when the wheels hit and I touch down day. Bow, bow. Welcome back to the channel, baby. Oh, it is a good night tonight. Let's go, boys and girls. It is the same night I have, or well, the same day I have recorded um, Buffy episodes 10 and 11. So I have spare time at night and I'm just like, instead of watching a movie, let's watch more Buffy and get ahead on the content because this is a big week. It's a big week. We got Stranger Things. We got Kenobi. We got Top Gun, which I should be seeing on Thursday. And my dad just came home with a new pop figure as a random present for me, and I was so excited. I'll show you. I'll show you. I am so hyped at the moment. I am so hyped. He got me the new Dustin pop figure from Stranger Things. It's not even out yet. It's on pre-order, but the guy at the store had it on display, and he took it. It was the last one. So hey, what a Monday it has been. Good workout in the morning, everything, and now more Buffy tonight. Oh man. I'm so hyped. I just got out of the shower and I shouldn't be sweating. Woo! It's your boy, Ellie Moses. Your 22-year-old law enforcement student in Hibbertson, Australia, shooting his shot, baby. We're watching Buffy episode 12 tonight and possibly 13. Now, realistically, this could be a quadruple upload today if I was bothered, but I don't want to get a quadruple upload up anyway. I've got two videos up and the skit has started to do really well. The views came out of nowhere on that. I don't know what happened, but um, it's doing well. But yeah. We are here to watch episode 12. I didn't even know what it's called. It is called Helpless. Okay. Let's get right into it, baby. Let's go. Oh, I got grapes here too. Don't worry. Oh, oh, yo. What are these practicing rehearsing and it's going to end up making love? It's not hard. Did she just use a bread roll? I'm not sure that's the word. As a steak? That's class. Okay. Very handsome. Likes it when I call him daddy. Uh, huh? Ah. It is your father. Oh. He's <laughs> taking me to the ice show. It should be big fun. I could use a little fun. Buffy's birthday again. Let's go. This one? Oh, that was really funny looking. Let's do it again. <laughs> Trying to kill me for the <laughs> Okay, so here's the deal. What? Yo, Buffy had a lapse there. Buffy fighting in tracksuits is pretty awesome. Oh, 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 oh. We're about to get a saving Pirate Ryan moment here. Come on, Buffy. What an idiot! <laughs> that was selfish blitzed. Perhaps you shouldn't. It's that Spider-Man 2 moment, man. Start losing our powers. That, I got a bad case of the dizzies last night and almost let a vamp take me. With 18 is a big one, Buffy. I mean, you can vote now. Yeah, you Buffy's turning 18. Damn! You can vote not to be dropped. <laughs> I he's a... Uh, Quarterly projections are unraveling, and he can't afford to take off right now. Oh. He promises to make it up to you. It's all right there in the letter. Damn. If you wanna, I could ask somebody to cover for me at the gallery. I mean, if you want me to take it. No. No, it's not necessary. So sad, because it's I was like... just thinking it might be nice to have a, a quiet time. She was really banking on the ice ring thing with his dad and the ice show. And even though she's been taken since a little kid... And it's it's something that she likes and enjoys, despite probably being outgrown from it. But sad man, the dad let her down. Very close. Hmm. Slayer's preparation is nearly complete. That old guy looks familiar. You know, it's not. I don't just know why. Characters. Huh? What did that Kyber crystal do? Giles just putting possessive things on the table, man. Seems like he came prepared for it. Is Buffy gonna wake up before he does it? Oh no, too late. Seems like Giles is doing something here. Hmm. And he's very serious about it, so he knows what he's doing. He's not shocked or anything. Oh, I'm sorry, did I zone out on you? Just I've never seen that flu bug. Hey, yo! Take care of that. Thanks. 
there might be something necessary Giles has to do. Good night. Oh, he's acting sus. Made me look like some kind of dork in front of my posse. First hey. of all, posse, passe. Second of all, anyone with a teaspoon of brains knows not to take my flirting seriously, <laughs> especially with my extenuating circumstances. Oh, wow. What circumstances? Rebound. Look it up. <laughs> I'm not Bro, this oh, guy's full on assaulting her. What the heck? Buffy's lost her strength. What is wrong with you? Oh. Oh, the chick started it. This is Buffy's Spider-Man 2 moment. I wonder if Buffy will go to Faith and ask her if something similar has happened. It's not easy for a slayer or watcher. But it's been done this way for a dozen centuries. Whenever a slayer turns 18, it's a time-honored right. Oh, it's okay. An archaic exercise in cruelty. Damn. Weakened, defenseless. Is it like a rite of passage? Unleash that on her. Something she has to do. She has to defeat that monster without her powers. If Luke and the Rancor. Still had actual contact with the Slayer. They would see you. I'm the one in the thick of it. And believe me, once this is all over, your Buffy will be stronger for it. Let's go. Or should we wait for it? Oh. Take care of it. Bro, what are they gonna unleash on her? Oh, looks like we're gonna find out now. Oh, it's just that vampire. Light work. Come on, come on. And I don't. A deal. We go to college, we move on with life. There's a whole lot of good sides to it. Actually, this could open up so many. <laughs> Did you find anything? Uh, no, not yet. Bro, that guy did not swallow his pills before. He's gonna bust out of that thing and wreck all these guys. Knew it. Knew it. It's coming. He is gonna get whacked. This guy is going to get violated. Shaking my head. Open your eyes. Hopeless fools. Bro, that's got to hurt. That's got to hurt. Thank you. Hey. Beautiful. Nice attention to detail as well on Buffy's neck. She's got bruising. Proving that she's lost her Slayer powers and she gets hurt easily and, yeah, does not have that sort of protection from her Slayer strength. You really like it. Of course I do. I saw you before you became a Slayer. Hey, nice callback to that episode. I watched you. That angel was spying on Buffy at her old school. Yep, she was called. Great afternoon at home <laughs> primary school. I like that we're touching upon that. Steps. Bro, you loved her from the moment you saw her? You can't do that. Because I could see your heart. Wow. What a simp. That's beautiful. I take him literally incredibly gross. Yes. See? I was just thinking that too. <laughs> Angel, you creep. Uh, that guy has some feeding. He's like, nom, 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 nom. Hey, yo, he has a servant now. This all, this whole rite of passage thing just got a whole lot harder. And worse. I wonder what happened to the old guy. Yeah, get the stakes ready, brother. Yeah, follow the blood because that always works out. Oh, so that's what is is that that's either the old guy or it's either the other guy in the other room with his partner. 
Yo, he must have been violated that bad. They couldn't even show it. <laughs> See, the thing is, she can't protect hey, herself girl, now. How much for a lap dance for me and my buddy? I will whoop your ass. <laughs> and then run laps around you. Yeah, see, Buffy's, Buffy thought for a sec. She's like, if I could take care of it, yeah, if she could take care of herself, then that scene, or that situation might have ended a bit differently. You know, I wish I could, but my mind just isn't what it used to be. Yo, seeing that guy in broad daylight now, not broad daylight, at night, but in better lighting. Is he played by someone familiar as well, this vampire? Like, as a guest star in this episode? He does look familiar, like I've seen him before, or like, I recognize the voice. You never see Buffy screaming like this away from vampires. She's the one usually attacking. Buffy being put through the ringer here, man. There's no fair. Just like working your way up in a video game. Getting all the high levels, all the gear, and all the things, just to face the final boss naked. And they don't allow you to use anything. When I hit him, it felt like my arm was broken. It hurt so much. Far out. I can't be just a person. Just please, we have to figure out what's happening to me. Kind of weird seeing Buffy like this, because we're not used to it. We're never used to it. Adrenal suppressors. How's she gonna trust Giles from now on? The effect is temporary. You'll be yourself again in a few days. Oh, that's all right. Naked, and then entrapped with a vampire foe whom she must defeat in order to pass the test. Wow. You can tell Giles didn't want to do it. Would have faced. Has escaped. When a vamp. Oh. All this time you saw what it was doing to me. She could have died, to be fair. You didn't say a word. I wanted to. Who are you? Fire. Yeah. It's like she doesn't How even... Could you do this to All me? that relationship with Giles just went downhill. Touch me, I'll kill you. Wow. It's like they've wasted years of being together now. And Giles protecting you. It's like nothing ever happened now. That one moment, Buffy didn't understand... I get, you get the way Buffy's coming from as well. Like, I, it's so weird. Because he can't tell you her. Have to listen to me. Because I've told you this, the test is invalidated. Oh. You will be safe now, I promise you. You can't walk home alone, Buffy. It isn't safe. Far out. She knows that as well because she just did that. I don't know you. Far out. She just disowned Giles. Did something take her memory? He's Giles. Giles. Cordelia's not helping in this he moment. Out here a lot. Cordelia, could you please drive me home? Of course. Hey, Cordelia, nice. This is literally Green Goblin tactics here. <laughs> Mother. That is Green Goblin tactics in Spider-Man 1. Remember Spider-Man went to rescue the baby and then heard another scream? And he's like, yo, there's someone else up there. And Green Goblin's literally covered like that. But my man went full on red, red, little red riding hood right there and baited her mother. <laughs> that is, that is so funny. The Spider-Man influence. Oh, this is before Spider-Man, but you get what I mean. My man took a selfie with a Polaroid. What a legend. This guy is a complete menace to society. And Giles did say as a human or as like a mortal, he did kill a lot of women. So it makes sense he'd be psychotic like that. She's even struggling to carry her steaks in her bag. That's when you know Buffy's down bad. Surely Buffy's gonna have backup here. She has to. Giles has to tell Angel, surely, or someone. Has Xander been in this episode? I think he was at the start for a little bit. Otherwise, I forgot. 
I have a feeling that stake is going to come back to help. That is in direct opposition to the council's orders. Uh, he yeah. survived. <laughs> Interestingly, I don't give a rat's ass about the council's orders. There will be no test. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Tell him. The test has already begun. The Slayer entered the field of play about ten minutes ago. Oh, how did he know? No. I returned there just as she entered. Oh, I okay. could. No business is not business. Yo, Buffy, you can tell she's like even really trying with her hits. Like it's taking a lot out of her. I didn't see it. This guy could be a villain for a whole season with the way his antics are. Like he could be a real nuisance for a whole season. Under the dark of the woods. Oh, he's Bring got all these sweets to grandmother's house. He's got her in a chokehold. That's it. Remember, he got the other guy in a chokehold. It's wraps. Oh, okay. She came prepared. <laughs> oh, oh no, no, just a little lower, right? There. Oh yes. This yes. guy is weird. Oh. oh. Thank you very much. This guy is. This guy is different. Built different. Oh. Damn, that's gotta hurt. Head on the stairs. That could have knocked her out unconscious. That could have been really bad. You rarely see Buffer. Buffer. You rarely see Buffy turning into like the slasher girl. Like the Sydney Prescott. The um. Oh my gosh, I forgot her name from Halloween. But you really turn you really see her turning into like the final slasher girl, which is like in this episode. She's running away in a house <laughs> from the killer. <laughs> Who's got various Polaroids of people he's killed. Or her mum. That's a lot. I won't it all. I'll it all. Someone's gonna save it here. What the heck? Have the meds worn off? Yeah, there we go. Ooh, that was awfully lucky for Buffy. Seem to understand your place in all of this. Do you have any idea? Oh my. What? What have you My pills? <laughs> <laughs> my men drank straight holy water. That is smart. Buffy came prepared, man. She bought the full slayer power. I'd be punning right about now. <laughs> she bought the whole arsenal with her. My man's getting burned from the inside. Get these as you can. Can't you just not right now? <laughs> Maybe there's some clippers around. She passed the test, bro. Give her, her powers back. Oh, yep. There's still one more guy. I forgot about it. Oh, Giles got him with ease. Don't worry about him. He exhibited extraordinary courage and clear-headedness in battle. This is the guy Buffy should be really going out. The council. Dragon. The test was unfair. I think you better leave town before I get my strength back. <laughs> For waging a war she's fighting, there is a difference. Mr. Giles, if you don't mind, the test is done. We're finished. Bro, that's, that's a cap test, man. That's a stupid-ass test. You're fighting a war, but you're gonna lose soldiers if you keep doing this stupid ass test. Buffy could have died there. One less slayer on your board. And you said at the start of the episode that you're, the, I think Giles is the only watcher with a slayer left. Like, that's it. I think Faith and Buffy are the only slayers. Kendra died, and her watcher is left with no one at the moment, unless a new one has been called in that area. She but passed. you didn't. The Slayer is not the only one who must perform in this situation. Uh-oh. I've recommended to the Council, and they've agreed that you be relieved of your duties as Watcher immediately. Woo! You're fired. Woo! This big? On what grounds? Your affection for your charge has rendered you incapable of clear and impartial judgment. Wow. You have a father's love for the child. That's mad. That is useless for the courts. Now Buffy understands. It would be best if you had no further contact with the Slayer. Or if you interfere with the new Watcher, or countermand his authority in any way. Uh-oh. You'll be dealt with. Uh-oh, this big, this big implications. Very clear. 
Hey, he's still employed at the school. He's still the librarian. Congratulations again. Shut your ass up. Bite me. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, this council's corrupt. Girl. This council's worse than the Jedi Council during the Clone Wars. At least they had certain decisions and they were fooled by someone better. That's nice, man. A father's love for the child. Wow. How did you manage to kill Kralik? Oh, she was very clever. <laughs> uh, you go ahead and tell it, dear. You tell it better. No, no, when you say fired, do you mean fired? I mean, he's been fired. He's he's unemployed. He's between jobs. You need to appeal the decision to the board. He's still librarian. Right side to everything? <sighs> Just feel better when I get my strength back. <laughs> Give you a hand with that, little lady? I wonder when she's going to get it back. You're loving this far too much. <laughs> Admit it, sometimes you just need a big, strong man. Xander's not even going to be able to do it. <laughs> Weak ass. I will. <laughs> Give me a hand with that. <laughs> oh, we didn't even get to see Buffy's powers in this episode. Damn. I, you, I'm guessing this might even be like a sort of like a mini two-parter where we get the introduction of the new Watcher next episode. And fun fact i'm gonna watch the next episode right now straight after this um i enjoyed that episode seeing a different rite of passage for the watcher age 18 another year goes by buffy is 18 now damn that was quick a lot of time has passed it's been ages since the first season 16 17 now 18 baby um interesting to see where it goes and yeah giles is fired and this show does a good job at following on from previous events so I'm guessing uh, hopefully it tackles the issue next episode and Buffy has her strength at the start of next episode. So we'll see what happens. Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. It's been your boy, Eddie Moses. It's been episode 12 of Buffy the Vampire Slayer season three. That was helpless. What a great episode it was. As always, take care. God bless and peace. See you in the next one.